Hello, my beautiful, beautiful souls. Happy, happy 2023. I haven't done a meditation yet for the new year. So here it is, um, very aptly timed, a little bit late, not quite on January 1st or even 4. Um, and I think that's very in tune with where I am at this moment in time. And I kind of wanted to share a little bit of that with you all. Because I think that sometimes as we enter into the new year, there's so much pressure. It's like the clock strikes midnight and we're in a new year and it's a new day. And suddenly everything is supposed to be different. But it's not, right? It's, it's just another day. Um, everything doesn't miraculous, miraculously change. There's no um, magic carpet that takes you to that place. Um, it's a new day. It's a new opportunity for us to continue creating uh, and being the most high versions of ourselves the same way we've always done by taking those little steps every day gradually. So I'm here without pressure to feel like I needed to flood your timeline immediately with tips and tricks. Um, I'm here to tell you to take your time. It's okay to take your time and it's okay um, if things don't fall into place perfectly. Uh, I often like to use the month of January as my settling in month. I like to settle in. I like to take time. I like to feel into what I want to create. And I often find that February is that month for me where I create the vision board and I create the plan um, because I've had that time to kind of marinate. So I wanted to share that with you because it's worked well for me in the past. And I hope that maybe it will resonate with you that maybe it will relieve a little bit of pressure for you um, to feel like everything has to shift immediately. You know, as they say, Rome wasn't built in a day, so take your time. Uh, my mantra for today is there is plenty of time. <sighs> Breathe that in, right? There is plenty of time. We're in such a culture of hurrying up, of rushing, um, of being so focused on the destination that we miss the journey on the way. So I invite you to slow down with me. I invite you to marinate with me um, in this meditation, in your day-to-day -day life. Um, I was reminded of a quote today by Abraham Hicks that a happy life is really just a string of joyous moments. It's a string of joyous moments. So let's just try to create joyous moments every day. There's no magical formula for a happy life. It's just really about taking the time to create and to find joy in all the little pockets of our day. I took Ava grocery shopping with me yesterday. And yeah, I did tell her to hurry up. <laughs> Cause when you take the kids grocery shopping, it always takes so much longer, right? Uh, but we were in the skincare aisle and they had all those yummy soaps that are handmade and smell so amazing. And she wanted to smell the soaps. So we stopped and we smelled the soaps and I reminded myself to just stop and smell the soaps with her um, because we get so caught up in where we have to be and where we have to go and we have to be on time and all of this stuff. And sometimes we just miss the little joyous moments along the way. So with that, I invite you to find your comfortable seat with me. Let's pause together. 
Let's create an abundance of time together because we deserve to marinate in the moments. So finding your comfortable seat, whatever that might look like for you. Uh, I'm sitting cross-legged on the floor. If that doesn't feel good for you, find a seat. If you feel like you need to lay down, lay down. Do what is nourishing for you. I'm gonna play some sound bowls. The sound bowls are tuned to different chakra points throughout our body. And they'll help to bring peace and they'll help to bring energetic clearing. Allow my voice to guide you. If you find that you lose my voice, that's okay too. Your only job is not to create stories as we meditate. Try not to create stories as we meditate. Try not to create lists as we meditate. If you notice yourself drifting into a story or into a list, just come back to your breath. Always come back to your breath. Let's focus on taking a few deeply nourishing belly breaths. Breathing into your low belly. Feel your belly as it expands. And then slowly exhaling the breath out, letting yourself settle in to this time Settle into the space. Nowhere to go, nowhere to be, just be here. Be here, be present, be in this moment. Allow the sounds to fill you with peace. Allow your breath to fill you with healing nourishment. Allow your rib cage to hold you up, to support you, to give you a little warm cuddle, a warm hug. Allow yourself to surrender. Surrender. Allow your forehead to soften and your eyelids to float ever so gently over your eyeballs. Allow your face to soften and your jaw to release. Allow the sounds to travel in through your ears your ear canals, bringing you sensations of peace and connection. And today is the Cancer full moon. It's a deeply emotional moon. So if you notice your emotions riding high, from them. Sit with them. Sit with them and invite them to speak to you. Ask yourself what these emotions may be trying to tell you. We have the tendency to run from our emotions because they sometimes can scare us. But sometimes the best thing we can do is honor the emotions. And let 
your soul speak to you. Allow your shoulders to melt. Allow your front body to open. Allow your back body to open. Allow your arms to be extensions of your heart, your hands. With which you give and receive love, your generosity. Let it radiate out. Feel your heart space expand as you breathe in. Creating space for love and compassion and forgiveness. And all the things that fill you with joy. And as you exhale out, feel yourself releasing fears. Releasing anxiety. Releasing anger or grudges that you may be holding on to. of yourself every day always growing always willing to grow always willing to evolve just a little bit knowing that it is okay if we're not perfect don't have all the answers. We don't have to. Allow yourself to sit. Allow yourself to surrender. I surrender to your plans. I surrender surrender to your plans. I open myself up to connect with the answers that you send me. I open myself up to connect with the answers that you send me. that you send me.
I have faith that the answers I seek will find me. I have faith that the answers I seek will find me. I'm a being of light. I'm a being of light. I'm a being of light. I connect with this light and I allow it to propel me forward towards the highest version of myself on whatever path that may be. I open myself to the light. And I allow it to propel me forward on the path that is meant for me. To connect with the highest version of myself. Slowly coming back to your physical body. Bring both hands over your heart and just breathe into your heart space. Breathe into any emotions that may have risen up. Let go of anything that you need to release from the year behind us. And breathe, most importantly, joy into everything that you do. Breathe joy into everything that you do and you will find your way when you are vibrating on the essence.
I hope that this meditation gives you a little bit of peace. I hope that it helps you to relieve any pressure that you might be feeling as we begin this new year. Surrender. Open yourself up to see the signs and have faith that the way will find you. My light honors your light and I wish you so much joy, so much love and so much happiness in this new year. Sending you all good things, my beauties, all good things. Um, remember that I have meditations daily and nightly that are available on all streaming platforms, Tara Natalie, Spirit Warrior Nation, just search for it. Spirit Warrior Volume 1, Volume 2. Um, and that is all. Wishing you all the good things.